Hello! Um, okay, so I don't know exactly what form this vlog is going to take. So today is the first day of the fall semester at my university. Um, and normally on the first day I would be getting up, check, done that, I'm awake, barely, um, I need coffee so bad. Um, I'd get ready, I'd get dressed, I'm dressed, I've got some makeup on, and then I would drive down to campus. Well, I'm teaching online this semester. Yeah, I don't have to leave, I don't have to go anywhere. Um, I thought it might be interesting for, for me, for sure, um, and maybe for some of you, because I know some of you are grad students, you probably teach as well. Um, some of you may or may not teach online, or may be interested in doing that at some point. Um, some of you are college students, um, and so maybe you've taken an online class. This will give you the teacher's perspective. Um, so I thought it might be kind of interesting to vlog the first few days of teaching online. We started on a Thursday. My university is weird like that. They like to start on Thursdays sometimes. So it's Thursday the 18th of August, which is also early compared to some universities. So just to kind of see what the beginning of the semester is like. Um, I do have work to do um, for myself <laughs> and for a class that I don't start teaching until later. Um, I'm taking over for a teacher who's going on maternity leave. So I need to get the syllabus revised and get to her. Um, and then I'm just going to be checking their, my students, I'm going to be checking their online posts today. Some of them, even though the their first post isn't due until midnight tonight, several of them already started posting yesterday. So you can be on that journey with me for this first week. I'm checking the discussion board to see who has posted, if anyone's responded. Looks like I've got three new students posting their introductions in the one class. Looks like I've got a few nine unread posts in this class. I'm I'm really impressed so far that students are doing work before, like, well ahead of the deadline. Um, like, obviously now today is the first day. Um, this is kind of when I was thinking I'd start getting a few people posting, um, but they're, they're doing pretty well. Um, so, yeah, I, I'm definitely learning already that this is going to be very time consuming or it has the potential to be very time consuming so I'm gonna to have to be really careful with that. My students seem cool though um, but yeah I have to remind myself that I have my work that has to get done as well. I might have to institute like I'm not allowed to teach until I've done a certain amount of work on my work each day. That might be the better thing to do and then whatever time is left can be spent on my students. It would be very easy to spend an incredible amount of time online with my students. Um, I still have I still have to prep week two. Um, I still have to work on the syllabus for the theater class I'm teaching. Um, and then there's my comps reading and then yeah so just to give you guys an example of what's on my plate comps and prospectus some writing research stuff that's outside of university um, and then teaching three classes it's a lot um, it's a lot so as tempting as it is to spend half of my day in the discussion board talking with my students because I love talking with my students. Um, I just don't have that time. <sighs> I look like hell. So day one is done. I'm, it's not even 11 and I'm like, just, I give up. Um, I read a few more um, introduction posts, more of my students have posted. Um, it's going to take a lot of time. I, I don't know, I'm going to have to figure something out so that I don't spend 
forever and a day on this, but it, it, oh, teaching online. If any of you have done it, tips down below, please. I'm loving it. My students seem great, but I'm just really worried about how much time it's going to take. Hello. Okay, so it's Friday. Um, it's 11.30. I've been up for a few hours. Um, I slept really well last night for a change, so that was nice. I think I slept for like almost eight hours straight, no waking up in the middle of the night. Oh, it was amazing. So I actually managed to wake up at about 8.30. I'm checking into Blackboard. Not every student posted last night, so I've already sent um, a message, an announcement to everyone today saying that I'm going to be checking them and grading them today and to make sure that you get your introduction posted because this is your attendance this week. It's tricky with teaching online because frequently I have students that miss the first day of class um, and they show up on the second day or um, they show up next week. Um, Normally I at least get an email and with online advice to students watching this, if you're taking an online class and for whatever reason you're not going to be able to log in, at least email your professor um, and let them know because I've got about five students in one class and one student in the second class that I haven't heard from. My classes are still showing as full, but students could be making the decision that they're not going to take the class and just haven't dropped it yet. Um, but that's another thing. If you know you're not going to take a class, you should drop it immediately because I've had two students already over the last couple weeks email me about this one class in particular wanting um, permission to override and I'm not allowed to do that so all I can tell them is watch online and see if a spot opens up so if there's a student who's going to drop it but is waiting until the end of the drop ad period like there are typically other students who are trying to get into the class I hate counting people absent in the first week like you only get four absences in the in both of these classes and with online, not posting in a discussion board counts as an absence. So that's another thing students should be aware of. Make sure you understand what is involved in taking an online class and what the rules are going to be. Do not sign up for an online class if you can't handle working online because it is very different. I'm trying to bribe myself with YouTube videos a lot of people have uploaded today. There's like a lot from my favorites and stuff. Um, so I think Fleur has a new video. Josie has a new video. Um, Alice Red has a new video that I'm dying to watch because um, I love her videos so much. And Tara has a new video. Tara Deebs, check her out too. Um, it's only one minute and it looks like it's all pretty flowers. So I might let myself watch that one really quickly after I finish um, responding to the last few um, intro posts in this current class. Okay, so I'm making dinner. I'm making a salad. Because um, it just sounded good. <laughs> I've done a bit more discussion board posts. Still missing some students, but there were some others who had. And, a lot of the students have already also gone in and done their second posts, their responses, so that was good to see. Um, they're so cute. They're, you know, excited to meet each other, and um, some of them are like from the same place and stuff, and so they're talking about that, and some of them are the same majors. In my one class, um, my academic writing, it is a required course for this particular major. Um, so like half the class is that major. Um, so they're like, oh, it's so great to meet you. And some of them have had classes together before. So it's really, it's, it's, I like it. Um, I noticed that the last time I taught it when I taught it face to face. Um, so that's kind of fun. Haven't gotten that much of my own work done, but 
I don't know. Today I'm just kind of feeling like whatever. It's probably all for today. I will probably check back in with you on Monday on the start of the new school week. So yeah, that's that's where we're at. And where you're at right now is propped up in my kitchen cabinet because that kind of works. So it's Monday. Um, I'm probably not going to vlog much today. As you can tell, I'm not doing that great. Um, some of you probably saw on Instagram, I hurt my shoulder last night. Um, I don't know how exactly I was moving boxes. I must have just messed it up lifting a box. Um, I don't remember feeling the initial injury. Like I don't remember lifting a box and suddenly feeling sharp pain. I just started to notice that as I was moving around, my arm started to really hurt. Um, I have some range of motion, but if I go in certain directions, it really hurts. I had ice on it last night. I'm going to try just alternating ice and heat today. Um, but I'm basically just in bed watching YouTube. Um, I need to try to post an announcement for my students just to remind them um, that they have work to do. I'm just so annoyed. I was going to run my errands. I was going to try to go to the gym for the first time in ages. I was going to get some of these boxes out of my living room today. <sighs> yeah. So that's where we're at today. Oh, so I just finished um, joining in the first day of the theater class that I'm teaching. Um, so I'm at the community college right now. Um, my arm, it's better. But it's still not great. Um, so thank goodness I've got physical therapy tomorrow. Um, right now I'm just gonna go to Costco and get some gas for my car and pick up my contact lenses and then um, probably go home um, and do some work. Hello everyone. Um, I, I look like hell. <laughs> it's been a long day. Um, my shoulder is better, but it's still not great, so I've got it in the sling still. Um, and I've got this pillowcase folded up to keep the strap from hurting. Um, I'm home. Uh, check in on online adventures and teaching. Um, my students have their posts due tonight at midnight and I just checked in on both classes and both classes are probably more than 75% posted. Some of them have even started responding to other people. So that made me happy. Um, so that's going well. This video is going to be a nightmare to edit. Note to self, never do a weekly vlog again. Um, this was not a good idea. So it's Friday now, um, and I'm gonna end the vlog here. Today I'm just going to, if you can see it's a no makeup day, I'm still trying to get my skin to recover. Um, it's almost three o'clock, I've been relaxing. Um, I need to take some Tylenol because I have a headache and I just am really, really tired. Um, so as far as teaching goes, um, Today I'm going to try to get the week three folders set up. That's my main priority um, so that that's there for any student that wants to get a jump on it over the weekend because some of my students seem really proactive that way, um, which is a good thing. Um, so I'm going to do that now um, and then if I am feeling up to it um, tonight I will read through um, their last bit of the discussion posts. I can do that tomorrow and grade the discussion boards tomorrow if I can't get to it today. So yeah, so that's been that's been my first week and a couple days of online teaching. Um, I'm learning a lot. 
I will probably do more vlogs on like my adventures in online teaching as I go forward. If you have more experience doing this than I do, oh, please give me your tips in the comments below because it's going to be an interesting semester, I can tell. Um, so yeah, um, I will see you in whatever the next video is. And I hope you have a great day and a great week and all that good stuff. Until then, bye-bye.